look like this. One adjustment after the quarter-final loss in Leagues Cup to Columbus Crew. Tanasiewicz drops out. Risa comes in. It's six changes for Brady and Kuyper's return, but it's all about the back line, Kalen. Terran, Shehals, Arigoni and Guzman all back in. Spring a surprise with nine games remaining in the MLS regular season. Away we go. And it's that time of year. Time to shine. And with so little margin for error. Five in the back at times. They've had to be compact and defensively they've looked better so far and they've done down this last stretch. Swinging ball towards the back post. It's hit towards goal and it required an early save. And a good save at that from Chris Brady. As NYCFC look to test once again. McFarlane. Morales. Keeping the ball rolling. Effort towards goal. Oh, wow! Something out of nothing. It's him again. The makeshift man steps in and steps up. Time after time after time. You can see the ball just dropping deep and keep an eye on Martinez who just drops a little bit deep and turns Kellen Acosta and just needs an inch. He's always thinking he's just trying to get it back to this right foot here and that one little preparatory touch and just sees that back post past Brady but too much time and space from Acosta but what a finish from Martinez. New York City has needed put the cones out as much as you'd like but you can see New York City they know how to use this space. Rodriguez back inside, Hidden Parks and towards goal it goes Martinez! Well, Nick Cushing described him earlier this week as a coach's dream. And the coach's dream has given New York City FC a dream start here at City Field. Comes from a throw in and Chicago go to sleep. And Santi Rodriguez just cuts it back across. And first to the spot is Keaton Parks. But this right here from Alonso Martinez is so good. If you want to see a striker in form that's confident, it gives you that extra little bit of pausa here, just waiting for the bodies to go flying and leaving him in their wake, just this extra little touch here from Martinez. It's just perfect. Tehran and Acosta go flying, and then just absolutely roofs this. No chance for Brady. Pura Vida, Martinez with his second of the match, and it's two goals up now for NYCFC. New York City inflicts further punishments. Again, the angle changed. Marlon, towards the back post, it goes, it is three, and the offside flag is raised, much to the relief of Chicago fire, Kalen Carr. You drop it back and keep an eye on this back post here with Santi Rodriguez, looks just a step off there on the back of Haile Selassie, but he doesn't really track him at all, and most notably Zach Thornton as well was in, on that Open Cup championship team, was now their goalkeeper coach. In they are behind, it's a really good save from Fries. New York City FC carved open. And still New York City FC persist. Martinez unable to find a way through. And eventually the referee does blow the whistle in favor of Chicago Fire. Yeah, but it's a good start here from New York City and Gray and Wolf. You can see right here Jimenez and Gray getting into it. Gray going to pick up a yellow card for hands up towards the face. NYCFC at another. Just wide. Avon Gray coming within an inch of his first. Two goals scored so far. Only Nashville and the Revs have scored fewer in the Eastern Conference. So they gathered by Matt Freeze. The intricate, the build up for New York City FC. He maneuver forward again. Morales down. And the free kick for New York City, but all the talking from the New York City FC bench will now be focused. Sierra is coming in, and that final pass just missing, but that's the right, that's the change in formation so far has helped him. Kuipers, can they find something? Kuipers! Yes, they can find something! And how? Chicago back in it! 
have paid off instantly. And you can see here, Kuiper is just tucking in side with that extra striker has allowed him a little bit more freedom to drift. And he comes out to that right flank and gets faced up one on one. And he shows you here, cutting across to that left foot. It's just perfect, picking out that back post pass freeze to bring Chicago right back in this. Well, that is a glorious goal. Gutierrez. It's the half a yard he needs. Now then, quiet for hand to her. Penalty! A penalty kick for Chicago Fire in the dying embers of the game. You can see the ball coming in from Gutierrez and Chihos brings it down off his chest and is just looking to put it to the back post. And you see that arm coming up from Gray, it's obvious. Lifts it up over his head, arm in an unnatural position, making himself bigger outside the silhouette. It's a clear penalty and a costly one potentially at that. New York City have been in control of this. A huge pressurized moment. A major opportunity for Chicago Fire to find a late equalizing goal. It's Gutierrez! He smashed it, Chicago Fire grab it, and they take the tie and run for the hills. After a long League's Cup layoff, Chicago came out in this match asleep, but the way they fought back, who they Can New York City find a goal? Can Chicago Fire defend? Miatovic with the ball in, headed to a goal, and straight into the grasp of Chris Brady. Julian Fernandez. Mueller on defensive duties. Well, the one thing that Frank Klopp has said you can always guarantee with his teams, they always fight. They always give everything. They always push. Chicago Fire.